How are we all doing everybody? Welcome back. I apologise if that was quite a reasonably long farming montage that I've edited in there. I just, I needed to convey to you how much farming I have done here because my goodness, it has been mental. All I do is just come here, hit all these barrels, hit the nodes, go home. And basically by the time I've done a full cycle round, I'm pretty much, these, these barrels have pretty much started to respawn again, so I just keep going and going. But yeah guys, I'm going to now go and smash the craft in. I want to make sure that we've got plenty of C4 today, because all I do, and this is going to be the last time playing on this server today, so I want to try and get, pretty much, all the raids done that we can. Let me just munch on my mushrooms. So thank you guys so much for your support. Leave a like on today's video if you do enjoy and if you are hyped. I know a lot of you guys really do enjoy these sort of raiding, end of wipe raiding episodes, and I'm sorry I haven't got any further than Satchel's this wipe, but that's what next wipe's for, eh? Okay, mission one. Let's go and find ourselves a little cheeky base to raid. Kind of like to raid this, but this shop's been sold out since, like, day one. There's nothing in the shop, but it hasn't decayed? So that could mean that the TC's got some stone in it, but... I don't, I don't need stone. All I all I need is scrap and um, things to research, like guns, armor, because I'm still rocking wood armor. Um, Kai, I think I've got one hazmat suit left as well, so I'm not going to risk that. It's kind of a ball ache not having metal, but because we've got the components for it. I think what got me raided earlier in the series was just building next to too many big rocks that people could jump on top of. I, I really do think that was a bad choice on my part. Oh, I could come unstuck with this being a boat base. Now, I'd normally go in through the doors, but I don't think it's worth, because these bases, both of these, seem to have triangles whereby I assume the doors go all the way through. This is an awesomely cool door skin, by the way. Someone let me know what type of door skin that is. Right. So on the back, actually, yeah, okay, so just up there, gotcha. Oh my god, there's an airdrop right there. Oh, mistakes were made, boys. There's an airdrop right there. <laughs> oh, we're going to get counted hard here. Come on, almost all have gone off, come on. Oh, I didn't bring anything to blow the TC up with. Yes, okay. Right. That's fine. I need to get something to blow the TC up with anyway. Is that nine of those satchels went off? Like, madness, have I never- I've never had that sort of luck. Hi, didn't I? We got loot. We got loot. <gasps> mm, didn't look like a lot. Mmm, initial estimates didn't look like a lot. Nothing even in that shotgun trap. We could pick into the rest of the base. Oh, no. Um, mmm. 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 Not a good, not a good, not a good one. The less said about that... The freaking better. Wow. Okay. Not a bad. Not a good raid, guys. But you can't win them all, can you? Let's be freaking honest now. Sometimes you fail raid, and that's that's part and parcel of rust. I'll take that charcoal because I'm really low on that. It's part and parcel of rust to lose and, and fail and not get exactly what you want. And unfortunately, we didn't. But maybe next time, we will. No. Not happy with that at all, though. Alrighty. So I'm going to roll in deep once more. health back. Airlock by chance. Airlock indeed. Oh, there's a dude. Freaking knew there'd be one. There's always a dude. He's always got the high ground. That's all full. No TC. Fucking 
470 GP though. Made some of that back. Yes. Fucking going for it. But I want to go and kill that guy first. Let's dump the stuff in base. I want to try and find him and kill him. Meh. Not great so far. There he is. There's another one. Come on. Back to base. Back to base. Back to base. Oh, okay. We got two guys around. So I don't want to take more satchels out just yet. where I was being followed. I knew it was. Yeah. Done, my dude. Toast those nuts. Boy. Oh my goodness, why was his TC not locked? That is insane! Two TCs in one go not locked. Oh, Arusius. Bullets, a lot of bullets. This bodes well. This bodes very, very well. Uh, M9, not bad, not bad, not great. 84 high calls, pretty good. 15 row components, alright. A ladder, I have got BP now. Meh. Meh. Okay. I don't need stone at all in any way, shape, or form. But it will take it. We'll take it. We'll take it. I mean, you can't. You can't go wrong with that. And then the big prize. Ah, it's again a lot of stone. Thirty-five days on this can. <laughs> wow. Okay, not a bad raid. I mean, any sulfur was there? There was five hundred odd GP, wasn't there? In the other bit, in one of these. Meh. Not so stunned with that, but. Onwards and upwards, I suppose. Come on, baby. Just do me that little pop. There we go. Turret by chance? No, but the metal airlock, as I thought. Freaking love. I know, uh, I know I've moaned about it, and I say I love C4 so much more, but Satchels, you just get a different kind of buzz from them, right? Flame turret. This looks stinks of a base with a flame turret in this. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, one pistol bullet, love it. Furnaces are both empty, so what do we have in here? I saw some guns, it's not actually a lot of guns, it's actually just four crossbows. A lot of cloth though, so that isn't horrendous. Another custom, I guess we could start using a custom, we could learn a custom, we could learn a Tommy. I'm gonna take these crossies. What was in this one? Uh, components, okay, components, not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad at all. Could do with a spring, I guess. Not bad, right, okay, I've done what you guys tell me not to do, and pick up all of the loot before I check all of the boxes, if that makes sense. But here we are. Mm hmm, 350 sulfur, some stuff. Like, I'm not going to sugarcoat it this time. To be honest, this this series, these raids here, these are that's not a great one. We've not made back our satchels. What is it like a K gunpowder makes four satchels? That doesn't sound right. But yes, yes, very much meh on that one, boys. Very much meh indeed. But there we go. There is everything that we can craft. Well, learn in terms of blueprints that I've got that I maybe want. I am. It's taken a hell of a lot of scrap and a hell of a lot of researching. But that's pretty much it. I wasn't really going to show you this bit, but I thought, why not? I've got. I've, I might as well record this little bit. So yeah, that's everything we've got for next wipe. I wanted to try and maybe do a huge compound next wipe. 
but I haven't managed to find high wood wall, I don't think. I'll have a look through my boxes and see what I've got. I might do a couple more runs to the Red Town, because if we can get high wood wall or something, imagine a huge solo compound for just us. That'd be mad next wipe. I think that could be the thing. Let me know in the comments if that's something you want to see. See how big I could make an AR base and be a compound. But yes, thank you guys so much for all your support. I apologise for the last raid, but I hope you enjoyed the rest of them. I thought they were pretty damn good nonetheless. So thank you guys. Remember to like, comment and subscribe on how you thought about the video. This has been recorded on Tills a solo only server. If you guys are interested, just search Tills down below in the no, not down below. Search Tills in the Rust community tab. And yeah, thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.